Hi guys, we all know that A Fistful of Dollars is one of the most exceptional western movies of all time. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into the world of A Fistful of Dollars like never before. We'll have the entire cast of Then and Now, and I will be revealing all of the juicy details about the original names of the characters and how the actors have changed since then. Okay, let's check it out together. Clint Eastwood was born on May 31st, 1930 at St. Francis Memorial Hospital in San Francisco, California. He played the character Joe in the movie when he was 34 years old in 1964. Currently, he's living happily at the age of 93. Crazy bell ringer was right. Money to be made in a place like this. If you're thinking what I suspect, I <laughs> no, I just uh, watched it at home, uh, but it was great. It was a great, great game. Who are you rooting for? You know, Mary Ann Koch was born on August 19, 1931 in Munich, Germany. She played the character Marisol in the movie when she was 33 years old in 1964. Currently, she's living happily at the age of 91. Try, just get going before the Rojos get here. Why do you do this for us? Freundschaftliche Atmosphäre herrscht. Damals kannte man das Wort Quote ja ohnehin noch nicht. Niemand hatte einen besonderen Ehrgeiz. Es war einfach das Zusammen. Joseph Egger was born on February 22, 1889, in Donowitz, Styria, Austria, Hungary. He played the character Philip in the movie when he was 75 years old in 1964. On August 29, 1966, Egger died from natural causes in Gablitz, Lower Austria, at the age of 77. Wolfgang Luxi was born on October 19, 1905, in Berlin, Germany. He played the character John Baxter in the movie when he was 59 years old in 1964. Sadly, on July 10, 1983, Luxi died from a heart attack in Berlin, Germany, at the age of 77. On fire shot. I'm John Baxter, sheriff. Daniel Martin was born on May 12, 1935, in Cartagena, Murcia, Second Spanish Republic. He played the character Julian in the movie when he was 29 years old in 1964. Sadly, on September 28, 2009, Martin died from pancreatic cancer in Nuevelos, Zaragoza, at the age of 74. Benito Stefanelli was born on September 2, 1928, in Rome, Italy. He played the character Rubio in the movie when he was 36 years old in 1964. On December 18, 1999, Stefanelli died from natural causes in Rome, Italy, at the age of 71. Sigurd Rupp was born on June 14, 1931, in Bregenz, Vorarlberg, Austria. He played the character Stefan Red in the movie when he was 33 years old in 1964. On July 20, 2015, Rupp died from natural causes in Rome, Italy, at the age of 84. Gian Maria Valante was born on April 9, 1933, in Milan, Italy. He played the character Roman Rojo in the movie when he was 31 years old in 1964. Sadly, on December 6, 1994, Valante died from a heart attack in Florina, Greece, at the age of 61.
continua ad apprezzare, anche se oggi viene eh, ingiustamente attaccato, il grande sforzo non solo umanitario ma politico. Antonio Prieto was born on February 2, 1905 in Aspi, province of Alicante. He played the character Don Benedict Red in the movie when he was 59 years old in 1964. On February 4, 1965, Prieto died from natural causes in Madrid at the age of 60. Mario Brega was born on March 25, 1923 in Rome, Kingdom of Italy. He played the character Chico in the movie when he was 41 years old in 1964. Sadly, on July 23, 1994, Brega died of a heart attack in Rome, Italy at the age of 71. Margarita Lozano was born on February 14, 1931 in Tetuan, Spanish Protectorate in Morocco, Spain. She played the character Consuelo Baxter in the movie when she was 33 years old in 1964. On February 7, 2022, Lozano died from natural causes in Lorca, Spain at the age of 90. Aldo Sombrell was born on February 23, 1931 in Valesa, Spain. He played the character Rojo gang member in the movie when he was 33 years old in 1964. Sadly, on July 10, 2010, Sambrel died from a cerebral infarction in Alicante, Spain, at the age of 79. Jose Calvo was born on March 3, 1916, in Madrid, Spain. He played the character Silvanito in the movie when he was 48 years old in 1964. On May 16, 1980, Calvo died from natural causes in Las Palmas, Gran Canaria, Canary Islands, at the age of 64. One of the two is the stronger. Which one of them is stronger? Well, the Rojos, especially Ramon. Before we wrap up this journey through the world of the movie A Fistful of Dollars, I want to hear from you. Who is your favorite character from the movie? What's this thing that they have that is so appealing to you? Share your thoughts and feelings in the comment section below, and don't forget to turn on the bell notification so you're always the first to know when new content is released. Your support and engagement mean the world to me. Thank you for joining me on this journey down memory lane.